Are we running? All right, uh, let's talk about Morse code for, for a little while. Um, time and time I hear from my friends or acquaintances I make uh, at radio rallies or ham fest, whatever you call them. Um, they want to learn, people want to learn Morse code, but can't be bothered um, to invest the time and the patience uh, to learn each uh, letter of the Morse alphabet. Um, let me tell you something, you're never too old to learn, unless you have Al Alzheimer's. You can learn Morse code in, in no time whatsoever. And there's a very reliable method available on the internet, small piece of software you can install and you learn it within two or three weeks without any problems. However, if you can't be asked to do this, then I would like to rec recommend this a little rather, well, uninspiring white box from uh, the United States, MFJ. And it's the uh, model MFJ, where is it? 464 CW Kia and Reader. Now this unit is amazing. It's one of the plenty methods out there or devices out there, oops, um, that enables you to send and receive Morse code without actually learning the alphabet. Uh, this is what it looks like. I hope the camera can pick this up. The Panasonic autofocus is uh, not the fastest on the planet, I noticed. It's got this little display and most importantly for you, a keyboard input. Where is it? Um, here is a keyboard input and you can connect any keyboard. I happen to have one here. It's one I made earlier. Um, all you need to keep in mind is it should have the uh, round pl plug. It's a PS2 uh, plug, I think they're called. Could be wrong there. And uh, not a USB keyboard. keyboard. Otherwise you're fine. you will be fine. Um, you connect it and uh, as you type along, this unit, this will light up. This unit will send and receive Morse code uh, very reliably. You don't have to press enter keys or anything like this. You press A and this will send A uh, through the outlet into the CW input of your transceiver and the transceiver will just send Morse code. It's uh, very reliable. It receives well as well. Of course, if you have a CW filter installed or a DSP filter, it works even better. Uh, 500, ki uh, 500 hertz is fine. 250 hertz is even better. Um, CW is, is worth giving giving a go. I mean, even even if you think it's not, not up to date anymore and uh, there's no need to learn CW. And you're right, there is no need, but there is no need to collect stamps either. And people still do it just because, you know, it's fun, I suppose. Um, and the amazing thing of, the, of this tool is I found that, um, well, I learned Morse code the hard way. Um, and uh, it was, it took me, it took me nearly a year to learn Morse code because I was young and stupid. I didn't know how to go about it. But if you use this one on a regular basis for, let's say, a year and uh, really give it a go, you will find that after a while you don't really need it anymore because the letters subconsciously go into your, into your, into your brain and you just you hear the sound and you know what letter or number it is. Um, give it a go. You will learn Morse code more, Morse code more or less automatically with this. Just give it time, be patient and have fun. The only downside of this unit, I, I will say, is uh, is the small display. So if you wear, you know, uh, reading glasses like I do, um, then uh, it's hard to read. It's backlit, of course. But if you have normal eyesight, it's fine. It would be a dream come true if there would be a monitor um, outlet uh, to get the, the display slightly larger, but uh, then it's not very expensive. I think it's about $250 or so. Not too sure. Um, hang on a second, be back. The unit has a very nice and uh, pleasant on the eye um, backlit display. And uh, if, you, if you wear eyeglasses, you should be okay. And if you have normal normal vision, then 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 great. Um, this is how it works. You just hit a key, and the unit transmits. You can of course um, change the speed, but uh, don't set it too high. Otherwise, uh, you're lagging behind with the keyboard. Just choose a key, uh, um, a speed. Uh, with which you are comfortable. And that's all it takes really. It's great fun. You can imagine now if you listen to this over and over again while you type while you type away, um, you just learn the Morse alphabet. If you like it or not, you will learn it. Give it a go, the unit is great.
This video, by the way, is not sponsored uh, by MFJ. Hey, MFJ, send me your stuff, I'll review it, and if it's any good, I say so. And then uh, don't expect it back, I just give it away um, to the viewers on uh, here on YouTube. I just pick one by random. How's that? Okay, um, they won't do this, would they? Um, enough said of the unit. If you can pick one up, pick one up, give it a go, and... Uh, Try CW, and I see you on uh, well on the CW portion of the uh, HF bands. Thanks for watching, and uh, please subscribe. I need to get a thousand subscribers so YouTube can pay me money again, and uh, I can take it to a pub. Thank you. Thumbs up if you like it. Thumbs down if you don't, or just if you can't be bothered. Well, thanks anyway.